here and I'm sitting hanging out with my mama girl and my fur tail Zoe because she be all in our mix. So today's video is pretty cool because we're gonna do the the how well do you know me challenge. And I know y'all look like, well girl, ask your mama, she knows you pretty well. Yeah, she does, but there are things that I'm sure she has forgotten because it's been a very, very long time. And then some things that you just don't discuss every day. What you think? Like we do know each other pretty well, but I'm sure there still is like some gray areas in like the, wasn't that? Ooh, I, I think that. I know you 100% backwards forward. Yeah. Pretty much. Yeah. So you're gonna have to really give me some doozy. I got about you know? eight, like eight to ten questions. So let's just see how this goes. Because I was really trying to think, like, what would be good questions for her to know? Trying to stump me? Yeah. I really was like trying to think. I'm like, mm. and it's like as you grow, you know, y'all, you guys' relationship grows. Some things you just forget because it's just been so long. Yeah. And then she got hella kids, so it's four of us. <laughs> I'm the oldest. She messes around and calls me my little sister name, my little brother name, everybody name but mine. I don't even trip anymore because I'm like, I don't know what she meant. I mean, I'm the first. You really can't forget your first. <laughs> okay. I'm oh, sorry. So anyway, so we have our tea. <laughs> tea party. I wish I had like some little biscuits or something oh, like that. Some so we cheer. Maybe some, some crumpets. Yes, what the hell is that? Crumpet. Oh lord, she's so fancy. She wants some crumpets. I don't even know what a crumpet is, but I'm sure it's like some fancy cookie. She's some tea and a crumpet. <laughs> okay. Alright, you guys got your tea or your wine or whatever you're drinking on over there. Alright, let's get this started. See, what do you have? Do you have wine or do you have tea? What you got? Okay. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about what's in my listen. <laughs> okay. Don't worry about what's in my cup. Okay. okay. Swear about your little tea. Okay. Okay, so I got a couple questions. Okay. So, okay. Okay. Are you ready to rumble? You gotta be ready for this, Mom. I'm, like, I, I am so ready, Sue. Okay. I, I can't even tell you. Okay. I'm totally ready. So, don't be trying to look all in my paper trying to cheat. Don't be trying to look all in my phone trying to cheat stuff. Go ahead. Go ahead. So, do I drink? And if so, what's my drink of choice? That's kind of two in one. So, I'm gonna ask you, how was it you know me? Zu, I drink. I, uh, yes. <laughs> you look yes. so shocked and like so concerned. Yes, I believe that you do because you're of, you're of an age. So of course you, you, you drink. So just because I'm of age, I'll be drinking. You're of an age. So, one thing I, so as soon as you get 21, you just be like, yeah, this is like, ah, I'm drunk. That's what I mean? Yes, I believe that you drink. Yes. <laughs> Probably occasionally though. Although okay, so I'm like an occasional drink. All right, okay. I like that. Okay. So what is my drink of choice since I drink? That purple wine. What? <laughs> purple wine. What purple wine? It's purple and it's bitter, and it and yes, I believe that's the one you drink. <laughs> okay. Really? Go ahead. <laughs> so that purple wine. I think she means like Merlot and Cabernet. Those are usually like my wines of choice when I do drink wine. Okay, so so I answered correctly. Yes. All right. Okay. okay. Ding, ding, ding. One for you. Uh, 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 uh. That's you right. You get a cookie. You get a cookie. The next question. What was my first car? Okay. This was a long time ago, y'all. I know y'all like first car, but I've had quite a few cars. I want to say um, your first car was a Cavalier. Girl, what color was this Cavalier? It was red. And it was, was it a two-door or four-door one? It was two doors and it was low down to the ground and it had big, oh my goodness. <laughs> my very first car was a 96 uh, Grand Prix, y'all. It was red. It's made by the similar, it, 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 was a, it was a Pontiac. Oh, it, was a Pontiac. <laughs> All right, now. it was a Pontiac Grand Prix, y'all, and that now thing set that thing set low to the ground. It was so low every time you went up, up, up into a parking lot, so, out of a parking lot. It was lot. so beat up, guys. I remember this one time. Actually, no, you beat it up. It was. So, it was. Well, yeah. I, I, 
I plead the fifth on that. It was half and half. Mm -hmm. But I mean, I had it for a while. And I mean, I think that I just was doing regular, normal wear and tear. But y'all, I remember a few times. You drove um, it up I in drove the hills it. at university. Yeah, I drove you it to drove college, it all the way in Florida. I drove it all the way to home in Fort that, Lauderdale. That car lived that I actually drove life. it from Fort Lauderdale to Chicago. That's like a 20 plus hour drive, y'all. But a few times in particular, guys, tell me why I was driving the car. It was beat up, y'all. The car was having transmission troubles. And I was, you know, little old me in the car, little old girly me. I'm driving the car, y'all. And in Chicago, there's like a four lane. Okay, so this is like one of the busiest streets in Chicago. It's traffic coming from all different <laughs> ways, guys. Like it's security cameras that you don't speed. They're crazy inter, uh, what's it called? Like inner streets. There's just the a lot going on. To the like point where I try, it's like six way intersections. To the yes. point where I try to avoid that street, guys. Because even when you get the light, you're like, oh God, is he going to kiss me? Is and he coming? Somebody is my gonna time go? Somebody going to run the light? It's just a lot. Tell me why, guys. I already kind of felt hesitant about it because I never take that street. Tell me why, as I'm driving, I'm going through the intersection. I told y'all how crazy it is, right? Traffic is coming from everywhere. But yet, it all has to pass through this one middle, this one median. <laughs> this is the median. These are the cars going around it. Tell me why my little beat up 96 Grand Prix, y'all, stops in the middle of the intersection. Ah. The yes. middle. When I tell y'all, yes. I just, I literally busted out crying. I was so fed up, so tired from work, so over this dang on beat up car. I was so mad, but I couldn't afford another one. I ain't had no note on it. It was perfect for me Every at that time. time. Y'all, it stopped in the middle of the ground. Towards I'm not the ground. It stopped literally in the middle. The it stopped in the way. middle of the street, guys. And I legit, I just threw my hands on and I just started busting out crying. Thinking back now, I'm like, girl, you could have been dead. Somebody really could have just hit you, smashed in the back. Y'all, I just sat there in the car for like what seemed like 30 minutes. I'm just sitting there looking around. I was so embarrassed. I couldn't move. I think the first person I called was my mama. What she was going to do for me a thousand miles away, I really don't know. But at that moment, y'all, it just was terrible. Anyway, long story short, that was my first car. Don't miss your little Grand Prix. I called it Ladybug. And when I first got it. Mama bought me all types of ladybug seat covers and the little uh, steering wheel it cover. So it was so cute. cute. And it adorable. was cute. Yeah. She bought me all kinds of like ladybug stuff. Shout out to you, girl. All right. So she got that question wrong, but okay. it just made me go With down. It just made me go down. Uh, you know. Yes. Back down memory lane. Okay. What's the next question? I next. Think it's the next, next question. One. Who was okay. my? We gotta get a little personal. Ooh. Okay. Ooh. Who was my first boyfriend? Okay. My chips, cheese. my rice, my white rice. I put cheese, y'all. Like classic Can American. Can I tell the story yes. about when you were little? Oh and Lord. Order, yeah, girl. Was... Go ahead and let the world know how loyal you are not. So go ahead and let them know. Well, okay. okay. Remember when you were little? In order to get you to eat the the boiled eggs and the scalded eggs, I would tell you that the yellow in the middle was cheese. Y'all, she would tell me that the yolk, the egg yolk, like the yellow, orangey part in the middle of the egg, she used to tell me that that was cheese. And for years, you believe. And I only ate it because it was cheese. 
Now, I'm not sure why at that age I love cheese but didn't know how cheese tasted because that clearly ain't tastes like no cheese. I, you know what? I, I need to reclaim my time on you. I ain't gonna okay, lie. Okay, okay, that was okay. some heartbreak right there. I need to reclaim that heartbreak. I'm reliving those feelings actually the more okay. I think about it. Okay, alright. Hmm. Next question. I'm doing so, pretty good. So, you are, I ain't gonna lie. Okay. You're like, you're like three foot four right now. Okay. Something okay, like that. Next, next I don't question. know how many you spent. I'm walking outside. Give me some good hard ones. Girl, I'm just going to be hard for you. Girl, really? don't act like you just been Zoe. that, done that. Zoe. If I'm walking outside, what okay. am I doing to my face? We're not talking about a full down beat. We mean like I can't go outside without what done. Like we all have like our top three things. Some people are like naturally so they can just get up, wash their face and go. Like, what is my, I ain't leaving the house unless this done. Like, what's my number one beauty trick or beauty hack or like, just needs to be I done? would say you must have on your eyebrows. Dang, that's true, y'all. Y'all know how I feel about brows. That's not right. That, yeah, girl, that's you true. You have to have on your eyebrows. You're not done unless you have your eyebrows No, that's true, on. that's true. Eyebrows are definitely my thing. Like, I don't care. Because the eyebrows, it frames the face. It makes it, it breaks the face. It balances the face. Yeah, yeah. It makes eyebrows make or break your face. Alright, all right, alright. Whatever. You doing good. What is my favorite color? What's my favorite color? Girl, you don't know my favorite. This is like elementary school. Hi, my name is so and so. Ooh, I like you. What's your favorite color? Like, this is like throwback, just meeting questions, girl. You know me for like dang over 30 years, girl. What's that? Honest to goodness, I, I've never asked you. I, I've never, uh, I'll be, I don't know. <laughs> I won't even try to fake it. If I, I you don't know my favorite. You I don't know what your favorite She ain't loyal. First she of all, loyal. you know why I don't know what what your favorite color is? It's because she doesn't have a favorite color. That's what it is. She doesn't have a favorite color, guys. So what colors do I what color do I like? She wears all colors. She appears to look attractive in all, pretty much all colors. <laughs> but as far as a particular color, like, oh, that's just my favorite color. Ooh, 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 ooh. No, no, no. no I, so think, I feel I like lie. I don't feel like I failed that question. No, you didn't feel that because one. you don't you don't have a favorite color. No, that's you true. Don't, as far as I know, that's true. Like I literally like colors. Period. I love floral prints. I love blacks. I love whites, grays, purples. Like whatever color matches my mood at that moment or that season. You know, sometimes you go out and everything you buy that day is turquoise for some reason. Turquoise purse, turquoise chair, turquoise lamp. It's like. Whatever draws me, whatever draws my attention that week, that day, that hour is like, ooh, that's my favorite color today. So, See? I ain't got no time. Alright. So, did I do good? You did, girl. Shout out to you. Oh! We gotta work on that, girl. We gotta, okay. we gotta, we gotta, we gotta work on that. Okay. See? Okay. Okay. Uh, we taught her, shake y'all, and she done messed it. We gotta. <laughs> yeah! Let's <laughs> try again. Nah. Oh, Mom, you gotta fly this way. I'll fly oh, that. Okay, okay. okay. Ooh! Like that. Let's do like a. I like that. All right. Oh, let's do that and then bring it back. Okay. 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 How's that? <laughs> We're gonna work on that. I'll let y'all know how it goes. So this has been the end of our how was do you know me? Honestly, for her to have known me, dang on that thirty years, ain't gonna tell my age. But for her to have known me for a very long time, she actually did pretty good because these are questions that we don't talk about every single day. We just go about our day and have fun together and just live life, live our best life. Exactly. So she did really good to Thank not you. have talked about these questions prior hand. She did right. great. Thank you. Now go ahead and make me some something with some cheese on the banana. <laughs> you got me craving. Right. You got me craving something now. Cheese on top of cheese on top of cheese. Yes. Okay. So thank you guys for tuning in. Make sure y'all like, subscribe, tell a friend, your auntie, cousin, sister, brother, all of that. So come check me out. Thank you guys so much for the support. I love y'all. This lipstick though. This lipstick ain't even coming off though. Bye. Bye. Say bye, mama girl. Bye. <laughs> Say bye, Zoe. Zoe's like, girl, I'm over y'all. I was like, oh. Yeah, so I was like, good night. <laughs> it was like, it's bedtime. <laughs>